Hi I'm Brian your friendly pharmacist. In this episode let's look at how open-ended and closed-ended questions are best utilized when obtaining a patient medication history. The general process to obtain a patient history by the pharmacist starts with broad open-ended questions, followed by more focused closed-ended questions to obtain more specific information. Let's look at open-ended questions first. These allow you to access a large amount of information from the patient. They usually begin with who what where, why when, and how. These encourage customers to share their information and engage in conversation with you while also giving time to pause, think and reflect. Open-ended questions also give the patient an opportunity to give you information that they otherwise may not have given. Closed-ended questions are used to ascertain facts or confirm information such as differential diagnosis. They are the types of questions that result in a yes or no answer and are usually used in conjunction with open-ended questions. For example after asking a patient, What are the symptoms of your rash? You may follow up with is it itchy? When obtaining a patient history it is important to know when to use each type of question. For example instead of asking a patient, Are you on any medications? It would be more appropriate to ask, What medications are you on? A close-ended question can then be used for further clarification as a follow-up such as, Are you taking any complementary or herbal medications? If this video has helped you out please consider liking, commenting and subscribing. Thanks and see you next time.